like a loaded weapon, yet you shoot me down with absolutely no... Here we are, and we are back with Stephanie Lee, and hello, how hey. are you? Talk in here so we can hear you. So Stephanie, how are you doing? Very well. How are you? Good. And um, what's going on in the life of Stephanie Lee? I'm getting ready to go to Alabama tomorrow. Oh, wow. wow. This is for you. Thank, Thank you, so Carolina. Thank Welcome. you. Yes, and the Brandon Salone, of course, we love so much. So Alabama, do you know um, in, in all the states, alphabetically, that is the first one? That's right. You know so much like that. So I know so good. much important information. I know you do. Exactly. You Tell know why me. I know that? Because my daughters used to know a song written by Ray Charles. It's called Fifty Nifty. It's called Fifty Nifty, and I wanted to learn it so badly, and I never could. Do you remember it? I know yeah. it. Uh, can you guys love do it? Come here. Are we gonna do it later? We can do it later. Oh, we'll do it later. It's the best song in the whole wide world. It goes all fifty states alphabetically. That's a great. Please do thing. it. We'll do it later. Yes. Yeah. You right. could do it. I actually would like to interview y'all. Uh, <laughs> so what are you going to do in Alabama? See my mom and daddy and be in my nice air-conditioned house. With some oh, air. you're a southern belle. Don't you, you hear it? it? I love but, the south. And, yeah, and I am so just enthralled to be among punk people since I've never known anything about it. It's sort of, it really, I never, I, so it's just sort of, it's like I feel like, you know. What do you mean? Tomorrow. Wait, wait. Uh, you're, you're enthralled to be around what? People like rock and roll people and and and, and I've never been so around. we're like a breed. Yes. I've never are been we like around? alien. Yeah, yeah. Okay. No, they are alien. What are you? 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 You you seem really cool to me. I, do, I don't know. I just don't know anything about. It. I never do. Do you, that. Do you wear like dresses sometimes? Well, you do like. Fancy dresses like in the South? You mean like Scarlett O'Hara? Yeah, of course. <laughs> well, that's Georgia. You're Alabama. Georgia. Yeah, I know, it's a similar yeah. thing. So, like, what do you it's eat in accent. Alabama? Like, what, what's it right. like down there? I, I, I want to go. I have really good friends in, in Alabama that have been asking for me to visit for a long time. It's one of the most beautiful states in the Union. It's wonderful. It's, it's lots of lakes. And I'm from a place um, in the foothills of Appalachian Mountains, a suburb, a town, but it's hilly with tons of pine trees. And do you have Spanish moss there? Is that like one of those? Well, no, we got pine trees. You got pine trees? Do you get cold weather? Mm -hmm. Really? Alabama gets cold? Yeah, it gets winter. Really? Uh -huh. what? Wow. So what brings you to New York? Came to college here. Where'd you go? Ever since, well, see, when I was a little girl, um, we used to come to New York on vacation, and we would go to the theater, and we'd go see plays, and we'd go to museums. And when I was uh, four years old, they still had the part of uh, Times Square that had uh, all the strip stuff. Yeah, the sleazy the, stuff. Yeah, the sleazy stuff. The stuff that was Times Square. Right, like Pace 42nd Street. Street. And I was four years old, and I remember walking past it with my mother and father, and I thought, this is grand. I want to live here. Uh, yes. <laughs> but that's, that's what it true. was. That's exactly what Oh, my what God. And the for. theater and the Marlboro Man smoke. Yes. And yes. There. And I thought, I'm going to live in New York. I thought I was going to own New York. I was four years old. Wow. So, you know, I met someone who said the Marlboro Man was their father. Do you remember that? Like, yeah, yeah this guy, he, he was like... He was his claim to fame was like that his dad was the Marvel. Oh, man. I remember. Do you remember about that? But I, don't, I was there. Oh, and I was like, what? I know. And that is really cool. Yeah, and that's all that guy ever did. He was the Marvel. Ever man. did like thank wow. you for smoking? He was in that. It's almost like he's like a, a shadowy kind of character. Yeah. He was wonderful. He draw. He brought you to New York. So how long have you been here? Um, since I was 16 years old. I came to college when I was 16, and right. then after college, I went to acting school. Ah. Yay. Are you, are you an actor? Yeah. yeah, I am. Where? Well, I mean, I studied at Lambda, which is in London. Oh, cool. Yeah. But I go, to, I go to school in Maine, so it's like, I'm not a conservatory kid. Okay. But I love conservatory kids. Yeah. Well, no, no, no. It's, it's all good. Yeah, I think whatever. So where are you performing now? Um, I'm not going to start performing again until... Well, I'm going to go Alabama for the summer. Are you going to swim in lakes? May sail and swim in lakes. Yeah. Lakes are like big, big lakes to you sail in. You can get to them, sure. Oh, well, sure. 
Wow. Wow. So you're gonna, but you are gonna play us a song. Yeah. And um, but I, I mean, I, can I just say one? Yeah. Thing? You are so delightful, and I, you know, I watched a bunch of, of, of segments oh. of yours, and you are so entertaining and so bright and so well spoken. Oh. And I wanted to say that it was just such a pleasure. Thank you so much for saying that, Stephanie Lee. Oh, that's so nice because we're going to get a juicy skeleton out of you anyway. Oh, I don't have never done anything wrong. I can't believe <laughs> that. She's from the south. Oh, uh, come on, come on, come on. Um, we're going to listen to a song. Um, we'll take a little break, set you up. Listen, wait, do you drink like peach iced tea? Like, what do you Sweet drink? Tea. What do you do? I just like have a southern affection. Yeah, you know, Eva well, loves when I was growing, with the South. When I was growing up, because my mother is a very proper southern lady. Did you have someone southern. nurse you? Well, yeah, I had a nurse. You had a nurse. Did you? Not a wet nurse. Oh, that's what I'm You know, you didn't? I just saw a movie the other day, like, where they did have the wet nurse. No, no. no. Oh, no, that was <laughs> Romeo and Juliet. Uh, I saw Romeo and Juliet, and um, Juliet had a wet nurse. Yeah, back in the day. That, that, was, a long, that, that was, was so long. I was yeah. the wet nurse. That was so before I was even shocked about that. Not, yeah, that was before my time. Yeah, I know. I'm just kidding. Just a bit. Just a bit. The, yeah. No, but I hear it still either. actually goes on, believe it or not, in, in certain families. Really? Yeah, in Murphy. Well, I guess if you, there'd be a... Yeah, I, I have heard that. I, I mean, I, I've I've heard that. I, I think I've actually met people that have been. How many um, more people it happens to than they would admit? It's people you know that live in those mansions like Scarlett O'Hara or or Fifth Avenue. You know. Yes. I have one quick thing to say. It's natural. I never believed when I met you. I never could have imagined that you had these two beautiful girls. I didn't think you were old enough to possibly. I, that, I'm just saying that I, it's, it, it, I it's crazy, that. isn't it? I know. I look at them sometimes too, and, and I mean, I was with them. Trust me, every single day of their lives, pretty much. I mean, they slept overnight in places, and I've missed a few. And she's been in London, but like, I know the whole time, every day, I have been there. Isn't it true? Good mom. Yay! Yay, mom! <laughs> Family moment. So now we're going to cut to break and listen to this lady sing, and we're going to hear a skeleton from your blog. No skeleton. Yeah, yeah. Understand the pain you cause.